Hey friends and welcome to Until Dawn, a brand new triple A horror game. It's gonna be awesome. I think it's made by Supermassive Games. I can't wait to get right into it. It's um a lot of famous actors have got together to make this and obviously the game company got to make them. If you like slasher films, which I think it's a slasher I've not seen any gameplay of it, so I don't know what to do. But if yeah, if you like slasher films, I think this will be for you. Let's uh, let's dive right in. Oh, the butterfly effect. A tiny butterfly flapping his wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane weeks from now. Tiny butterfly, devastating hurricane. Don't seem like important words. Oh dear, look at the butterfly. Right, I, was, I have no idea what to do in this game, so I think it's choice based, which would be great. The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. So yeah, it's a choice, choice based game. Oh, what the fuck? Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. Oh my god. Your story is one of many possibilities. Oh, great. This is amazing. Choose your actions carefully. Okay. Oh! Alright, here we go. Oh my god, it's like, um, what's it called? Uh, uh, You're Next? Have you seen You're Next on Netflix? That is a great film. You're Next. It's quality. Alright, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, there he is. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh, shh. Don't you guys think this is a little bit wrong? Oh, come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. Okay, I like the I like it so far. It's gonna be good. I like the uh, it looks really nice. Like I don't know how many people play this. I've said that, but it does look looks exceptionally nice. Well, Hannah. <laughs> All right. Oh. So they're in a prank or something. What's going on? She's here. Hi. Mike? It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. There's a bit of a lag between the audio here and the TV. Probably because I'm playing the audio through the computer, so I get the scares. Okay. If I play it through the PlayStation, you can't hey, hear the audio. did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Let's turn up a bit. Oh, I'm playing! Oh, wicked! Oh my god, this is sick. Alright, oh! What's that, Glint? What's that? What is that? It's shiny. Can I press to get... Can I get that? Can I get the shiny? Okay! Alright. Okay, what is it? R2... Hold right stick. Hold R2 and use right stick to inspect objects. Hannah! You look so damn hot in that shirt. But I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2am. Winky face. Mike, kiss, 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 kiss. Obviously, not Mike's handwriting. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Ugh. Intervention time. Oh my god. Who's this? Who's that? He's wasted. God, this looks beautiful. Right, what's in the room? Okay, nothing. This will kind of be like a, a, a full walkthrough. I kind of want to get every secret, every everything this game has to offer. I kind of want to go and see what it does. That fire looks beautiful. It's gonna be one of those games which I will probably come back and play on my own and do like if it is choices, do the do the different choices. But we're gonna try and play. Oh, that <laughs> phaser! Because uh, uh, <laughs> um, I'll, I'm gonna try and play it for real first off. So I'm gonna play it like I would be if I was in the situation. So for nothing exciting over here. Nope, that's exactly where it came from. This place is really nice. Like, really nice. Use the right stick to look around objects like glint. 
expected. So we looked at that one. So that was this one. Oh, it's a bottle. Jeremiah Craig. Nice. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, <laughs> you've outdone us all. Oh, my tea for usual. Usual tea that I drink. I got your note. Glad you can make it. Mm-mm. Maybe we should start no. a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Nah, she bad. No, hell no. I want to get my shirt off. I want to show you the goods. That was really bad thing to say. Oh, she got a butterfly. She's taking her shirt off. Uh oh. Oh my god. Oh, she's got a selfie stick. Hi. What the heck? <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh. Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, this all got out of Just hand, a but... stupid prank. Uh, oh dear. Hey, you guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! Oh, oh, got shoes. Amazing. Okay. Uh. Wait, wait, Josh. Find out. Ah, uh, Josh is our brother. Um. I would wake Josh. I would wake my brother. I'd try and get my brother up. Get two, what, two people at the one. Josh. But he's completely Josh. useless, apparently. <laughs> God's sake. Guys, there's someone outside. All right. What the hell? Oh yeah, there's Hannah from first. <laughs> Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, no, I don't like man. Her. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person yeah. wants to see right now, Mike. Mike? Which great action before the time run runs out. It's just like. Oh, shit! QTA? QTA! God damn it. Jump. Yeah, what's that? Oh. Ah. Uh, gotta go safe. God, I would not go fast. I'd be safe. Yeah. Down the steps. It's not a ton of break my ankle by jumping off. Who does that? Who does that? Right. Okay. Doing good. Doing good. Doing good. Beth? Yeah. Oh. Uh. Oh, noise! Ah, uh, ah, uh, noise! Noise is more likely to be human. Yeah, watch out for that log, it's really bad for you. Damn God it, damn Hannah. it, Hannah. Where are you? Aww. Oh. What do I do? Choose again, footprints? Shadow? What? Uh, yes, obviously following the shadow. Oh no, I'm gonna get killed already, aren't I? I don't die, I'd be so... Alright. Oh, yeah! Oh, that's cool! I got my phone! That's sick! Oh, this is so cool! Okay. Status yeah. update. Nice. You can direct the light beam using the red stick. Yeah, direct the light beam! Oh my god, we've got a lightsaber. Vroom! 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 Zoom. Zoom. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> so this is a massive. This, is a ma this phone is supposed to be depleting its battery. Look how powerful this light is. It's insane. Oh, watch out, tree. Oh! <laughs> Jesus Christ. I want to walk faster. Hello? Hello? What's that? Shiny. Oh, what is this piece of wood? Oh, it's like a, um, a Lego. Oh, shit! Death Totem! The fudge? Uh, possible death for the person who finds it. Damn it! No way! Oh. Oh, wow. Does that mean I'm dead? I'm gonna, that means I'm, I'm gonna die. Great! Right, so, okay, there you go, guys. Spoiler alert, Beth dies already. Is that even... Surely, if, that, if they're, like, linked into the game, there's going to be a lot of spoilers. Because you can just find a death toad and be like, Oh, okay, this, this character's dead. Oh, fine, later on. You can be like, oh, this, this character's going to die. Yep, 
How do you know that? Because I found a Hannah. piece of wood that told me. Hannah. She throws. Oh she's God, wearing she's nothing. Freezing. She should be. Like, Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. The fuck Anna? was that predator? <gasps> what was that? <laughs> Alright, so it's not. A, is this a slasher film? Or is this like AVP? Anna! Do I? Have, no, I'm gonna say I don't have the choice. Because I wouldn't. Oh no! Phone! My phone! She dropped my phone! Oh, Jesus Christ! It's my jacket! She dropped my phone! You bitch! Go! I don't care! Smack her off! No! Fringe style! No. Oh my god, it is Predator. Get back, fuck! No. Oh, what's good? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I love that shot! And bracelets. Hold on! <laughs> Hold okay. on! What else are we going to do? Oh my god. He's, hard, he's giving us a hand. Seriously, if we go and help him. Uh, bye, Anna. Sorry. Gonna go. I'm so yeah. sorry. Help me up. Help me up. Oh no, I've got Ah, oh, shit! So, I'm wondering, if I didn't let go, Dr. AJ heal, would I still live? If I didn't drop her, maybe? No, because I said let go, I would have died. Before we begin, Shit. there are a few things I oh! need to make sure you understand. Uh, you see, no uh, one can change what happened last year. The past is Peter Stormer. control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want Good. you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Okay, you speak a bit weird. A face! <laughs> All right. We will start with a simple oh exercise. Could you please pick up a card? A card? Oh, oh, shit. And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most okay. out of this experience. <laughs> Your face! What would I look? Like? Like, what do you want me to oh, Okay, I'm looking down. Yes. And look. Oh, great. I love that barn that's creepy as shit. Your face is creepy as shit. So, how. Did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Um. Well, not doesn't make me happy. I wouldn't want to go on holiday or vacation. I feel uneasy looking at that. It's weird. Okay, honesty mm -hmm. is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? Your fucking face. Look at it. Um. Not. Not the scarecrow. I'm not sure. If it is something you cannot see, then why does it make you feel uneasy? I mean, is there something yes. in the house? I think it is. I think it's in the house. It's just a weird, weird feeling. And this thing in the house, is it alive? How, the, how, the f how am I to answer that? I've not been in the house. It does feel. It feels like it's. A, yeah, why not? It's alive. I see. And is this threat human, or is there some other fear that you would like to talk to me about? Um, it's not human. <laughs> it's not human. 
aren't you? Is that so? Rather what? time for now. But I would like you to think about your... Oh, your freaking painting is horrible in the background. inhuman threat inside of the house. And next time we will unwrap it. Amazing. Don't, 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 don't weaken me. Don't smile at me. Go away. You're weird. Leave. Look at you. Oh my god. Creepiest psychiatrist ever. Or analyst dude. What the heck? I wonder what that does. The choices I made. I wonder what that actually is, is there for. It's only computer entertainment. Super massive game. Won't you spare me over till another? Until dawn. I love this so far, this is quality. Oh my god. I don't know I don't know how long I'm in this episode. I'm gonna go keep going until I wanna stop. This is awesome. I love what's that what oh, Hayden Pen Ah oh, Yeah there you go. Hayden Panettiere. Hayden, Hayden, Hayden Panettiere? Ah, beat the storm there! I thought so, I said it beat the storm there. Oh, that's the tune, the tune's good. Brett Dalton, Rami Malek, I've heard of Brett Dalton. Not of Rami Malek, though. Aladriel Stein, man. Noah Fliss. Wow. Jordan Fisher, Nicole Blue. It's quality. Megan Martin, Ella Landini. Oh, it's, it's Choose Kicking. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Hey, he hated be hiding there. My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. I love he feels. It's all the time with me. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters, and, you know. Okay, so, let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one all trip right, but, uh, that we'll never forget, all right? Yes! Okay. Right, I don't understand that. It's like such a cliche. In... Oh, back. Woo! Larry Fessenden. Oh, he was in a film I just recently watched, I'm pretty sure, called Pod. <laughs> awesome. No, but, um,. Yeah, it's always a cliche in horror films where like a massive event has happened really bad and teenagers or people just go back and like, oh, I'm gonna go back to this awesome, really bad place and 
a party to commemorate the death of people and stuff. It's really weird. I wouldn't like. I wouldn't do that. I don't think. I don't think they would want. Like, would I don't think they would want their death to be commemorated by like a giant party or a giant. Pardon me. A giant. I don't know. Fucking porn star gang bang or something that's going on. I'm not sure. It's not a game I'm playing, but it's sounds good. Okay. Chapter 1! Memento Mori! 10 hours until dawn! Quality! That's me! Awesome! Okay! The, the killer's there! The turn to have to walk! He must have- How does that make sense? Okay. Is he there waiting for ages? <laughs> He's there waiting for a year, just like... Okay. Ooh, Sam! Hannah's best friend! Diligent! Considerate! Adventurous! Okay, Hannah's best friend. Hello? Someone there? It's the cameraman. Sam, half the cable car station, 902. That's kind of the time it no it's not. Over here it's at twelve o'clock, so. You can use the right stick to move the camera. Okay, that's what I'm doing. Ooh, I love that you move their head. I think it's pretty cool. I like the get-up she's going. She's going for like, the half Scottish, half Russian look. I quite like it. Let's look around. Obviously, that glint can be expected. So, there's this note on the fence. The gate. Oh, what? The gate's busted. Climb over, Chris. <sighs> so, I, so I'm... Oh, okay. So, I climb over Chris, or do I climb over the gate? I'm guessing I'm climb over the gate. Okay. So, I see Chris. I'll just climb over Chris. Uh, just got to go safe. I got a feeling this is gonna be the death of me. Going safe. <laughs> See it happening. Uh old climb. I'm not jumping. I'm not that badass. Oh shit! Oh for fuck! <sighs> Gotta go safe. Okay. First obstacle in the game! And I'm still failing. Got lucky they didn't actually this wouldn't kill you, could have killed me with it. Like, okay. There goes Hayden Fanetia, dead by a wall. Right. Oh, is it that does not take that? You know, it's not that hard to climb a wall, surely. Oh, I apologise for yawning. It's been a long day for me. I have to wait till this downloaded. It's a strange download this game. It like it had 9.996 gigabytes and downloaded. And I was like, oh, okay. Then I looked back on it. and I was like, oh. A download files is being ins oh Hey little fella. Well, you controls. Huh? Not moving. Not moving. Not mo oh what the f I oh, didn't move! Cutie. It still worked though! I didn't move! That's bollocks. Uh oh shit! This is awesome! Okay, I like this. Character traits, okay. Honest, charitable, funny, brave, romantic, curious. Uh, Ashley, Chris, um, I'm kind of like the the the, the, uh, the neutral one and the neutral friend. Everyone's got that neutral friend. I mean, obviously, I don't like Jess and Mike that much, but I'm okay. Everyone else, I'm just like, yeah, I like, yes, cool. She kind of seems like the friend that we be invited to every party because she kind of gets on with everyone. I wonder how that unfolds with every other character. Maybe you've got some, okay, got some relationships with like. That's stronger with the character. That'd be awesome. Alright. Okay. What's that say? Be, oh, this. In. Oh, and butterfly prophecies. Oh. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believed that butterflies carried dreams and prophecies of possible futures. The color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Death. Black butterflies prophesied the dream as death. Danger. Red butterflies warned of dangerous events. Loss. Brown butterflies. Butterflies foretold a tragedy affecting friends. Guidance. Yellow butterflies are offered visions to help and guide. Fortune. <laughs> fortune. White butterflies brought dreams of luck and good fortune. Right. I'm guessing. Okay. Do they correlate with the. They do. They must do. Yeah. Oh, wicked. As you explore, you can discover totem artifacts. Picking a totem up and turning it around will reveal a butterfly. And a premonition of a possible future. Wow. 
Right, okay. Pick it up. Oh, yellow. What's that? Guidance? Oh! Yeah, guidance totem. Okay. So I got a guidance totem. A death totem. A guidance and a death totem. Sick. That's cool. The future is uncertain. Whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices that you make. Oh my god. This looks beautiful. That looks amazing. The past. The past is. Wow, yeah, what the heck? The the past is beyond our control. That. Well, that's the state and the obvious, really, isn't it? Really? If, if, well done! Clap, clap, clap! Figured it out. Chris? Oh, it's Chris already. I don't even know who Chris is. Oh! Someone left their bag and phone! Out. Bag's here, where are you? You're not in <laughs> your bag, are you? His head pops out like, hello! Hello. <laughs> oh, I can't do that. No, that's someone's private thoughts. I'm closing the bag. I'm not snooping. Maybe I no, I'm not poking Chris's stuff. Fuck it. Yeah. Okay, so I got a white one. Chris, Ooh. Sam, hey, you made it. Oh God, Chris has a crush on Ashley. Methodical, protective, humorous. Okay, and he's got some fucked up lips apparently. <laughs> oh, so I found something kind of oh, yeah? amazing. What? I'm not gonna tell you. You gotta see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Gonna blow your oh mind. my god, what was that? <laughs> gonna blow your mind. That's awesome. Alright, what's it? Oh, what's this? Glinty glint, glint, glinty glint. Oh, clue found. Oh, man. Look at this. Wanted Victor Milgram, nice. sex, mayor, height we'll six foot two. Last known address, Blackwood Pines. Six, Last seen, 16th of March 1998. Oh, Wanted in connection with the first degree arson offense as well as various death threats. Anyone with information regarding this danger? Criminal should contact the BPMC. That would provide to mount on stab very Police Monte Provisional de Blackwood. July 1998. When's this game set? I can't think of when it's set. Because it's got a sel she's got a selfie stick, or he had a selfie stick. I think this oh, that's probably an old old one poster, but that's obviously the flamethrower guy we saw at the beginning. Ta da! Oh what is it? Red, right? Yeah. yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? Good question. What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base That's of the Lodge? That's a question. Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Even better question. Do it. Uh, no, oh, Chris. I'm playing as Chris now. Alright. Final eleven. Here it goes. Oh, we got the shooting things! Yes! 10 out of 10, this game ever. Alright, beep, poof. Beep, poof. Oh, uh, poof. Whoa. Beep, poof. Wah. Beep, poof. Wow. Right in the set. Alright, I'm bad. Oh god, no, stop, stop, stop it, Chris! No! It was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, I don't think so, girl. Ah, what's this over here? Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh no! Why am I shooting this squirrel? Fuck that game. I wanna get the good ending. Or if there is a good ending, I won't get. It's the motherfucking deal, double. No, 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 no. Oh! Nice shot. Your ass just got Oh no, yeah. stop! No! I love it! Hey, sharpshooter! The right man of the man talent. Wait, the I'm puns. just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Oh, there's a bird. Okay, Chris, what are you doing? Data set. Alright, what's over here? Anything over here? Anything valuable of sorts? Or leave this location and go to the cable car? 
It's definitely weird. Let's go back to the gun to shoot some shit. Yeah, I swear, good? the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Here goes fast. What's Chris saying when he looks at it? Nothing? Okay. I, I thought, like, it'd be cool if, like, if one character looked at something, they see, like, a part of information. If another character looked at it, they'll see the rest of the information or something. I think that'd be a pretty good idea. It must be really it's good, net. gosh. It'd be a bit. I, I don't know how he keeps it all together. I... Hey, that's weird. The door's locked. Shit. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Alright, so we're going in. You got keys? Obviously so. After you. Oh, real gentleman. This game looks so beautiful, it's unreal. It actually looks so nice. Can we, uh, can we push her off? Should she be the first casualty of the game? Whoop push! Da -da 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 -da. And I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting <laughs> range. How long is this gonna take? Uh, three days. It's a big mountain. Yeah. Black Pines, Hotel Sanatorium. For a healthy body and mind. Sanatorium! Sanatorium, sane, sanity. What a crazy place. Sanatorium, to that's, a, that's a no mental institute, I think, that's isn't it? Or is it sanitation? It may, be a san it may be a spa. That's probably why it's called a sanatorium. Sanitation, not sanity. What am I looking at? Oh, what? What's that? Is that us? What's that about? That's a. That's a camera! Looking right at the ski lodge. What am I looking at, game? Anything? That's weird. There's a camera. I didn't realize there's a camera at the ski lodge. What else is that? Can I go out, Can I go out and look at where that is? Is that done here? Oh shit. Finally. You coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some skis, <laughs> but. I might just do one last look, look around outside for that camera, then I'll come back in. So I'm gonna see if there is actually a camera. Okay! Fine! Can I, can I look back on, on the computer? Oh, can, hang on! Hang on, Sam, I think your name was. You know what the shit's this about? There's actually a camera directly staring. What? Staring directly at the, uh, at the ski lodge. It doesn't show anything. Oh, that's, that's interesting. That is, that's absolutely thrilling. Alright, let's go. Let's go, let's ride the ski lift. Cable car, same thing. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Here we go. Right, adventure Dick. begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, get everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good oh. talk. <laughs> Hitting on him. You know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on yeah. the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became oh, friends yes. to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off a train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. He just explained the whole game in that one little flashback. Boom. Butterfly fit. So is that for foreshadowing? Might have to go and 
snap, some train, strap, snap, 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 strap, strap, snap, 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 some training bras or a. Okay! Jess, Mike's new girlfriend, I'm bloody terrifying! Confident, trusting, irreverent. Oh! I thought it said irrelevant. <laughs> irreverent. <laughs> Confident, trusting, ah, uh, irrelevant. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people, time to meet and greet. So, Jessica, are we playing as you now? Oh, amazing. Absolutely what I wanted to do. Right, I think we'll play Jessica for a bit and then we will end the episode. Jesus fucking Christ! What the hell? Jess! Hey! Jessica! Over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird yes. stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Uh, Yeah. What else will I do? Stand there like... No! Oh. My. God. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael oh Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder... Well, actually, uh, Chris, I'm with Mike now, so uh, you can... Uh... Mike and M Split were together. Whoa. Mm. Not really. Pretty clear-cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. So works, is it? It's just a Oh! Alright, alright, let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I I'm still don't know how to play the best. characters. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. So they're, like, they're all very cliche in their own, in their own way. <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Just, Sometimes I feel amazing. Stop it. Let's see, uh, Sam's like the main. Okay. Can you they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Oh god, this one. Mike's ex. Bitch. Bitch. And mega bitch. Alright, intelligent resource or persuasive? Great. I should resource for this. Like pretty... Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Motivated, ambitious, active. No. And oh god, where's this the is also the joke. Alright, I'm gonna end this episode here. We've been recording for 37, 38 minutes. Um, yeah, so I want to see what his, what his relationships are like. Ashley, Chris, like, non exists. Chris, he hates Chris, apparently. Um, Emily and Jess are very. Okay, he likes Emily and Jess. Josh and Mike, he doesn't get along with. So, so like, all the women, he's like, play ya! Yeah! All the men, he's just like, fuck off. Right, this guy's not funny or brave, but he's honest, romantic, and curious. Amazing. Okay. Right, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. This going to be an amazing series. I already know. I can feel it in my bones. Um, weird. I can, I, can, I can feel it being an amazing series. Thank you so much for watching, guys and gals. Um, please leave a like if you liked it. Comment what you liked about it. And subscribe for more. Until dawn. And until... I don't know what I was going to ask. Ending or something. And stay tuned for the next episode of Until Dawn, bringing you guys, bring it to you guys right out soon. I can't speak properly, bitch. I'm so tired. Um, yeah. Bye.